Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to read text file in Android. So create one blank activity Android app and inside its XML view, add one text view. Okay. This is so that we can read the content from text file into this view. Okay. Set its layout with two wrap content height to match parent so that we can scroll properly then add android scroll bars property to vertical okay also add android id and then set add the rate plus id slash text one okay now inside main activity java we are going to write the rest of the code before that i want you to add sample.txt or any txt file within your raw folder your text file could be something like this or you can add as much content as you want okay you can increase its content so that we can properly scroll and see how it works with scrolling okay now inside main activity dot java we're going to create instance of text view okay now here we have to also instantiate our text view so text view equals to in bracket text view and then find view by id our id dot text one so this text one is id that we set here within our activity underscore main layout okay now once you have that the next step is to set moment method for it text view dot set moment method and inside that use new and then scrolling moment method okay so that we can do the vertical scrolling action now once we do these things we have to think about reading our text data so create one string name string data and keep it now okay so the next thing to do here is create string buffer so string buffer s buffer equals to new string buffer okay so we create instance of our string buffer class next is input stream and here we call for this dot get resources dot open raw resources and then point to our raw and sample sample is my text file okay now once I call for that, next thing is call for buffered reader. Reader equals to new, then buffered reader, and here we point to new input stream reader. Okay, and then pass our input stream. Okay, now after closing this, we are going to create one condition. Okay, if our input stream is not null okay then inside this I'm gonna use try block and then use while block to check whether my data is null or not so let's check data equals to reader dot read line okay so this read line is method and here I'm gonna check whether it's null or not it's not null okay and then here I'm gonna use s buffer dot append and I'm gonna append my data 
width slash n so that each new read line becomes appended here okay so we have our now outside our try block I want to add our text view to get appended with our buffer so set text here s buffer and then finally close our input stream okay so this should clean our input stream and then finally use catch block okay so here we make use of catch then exception e and here we type in print stack address. okay so this takes care of our catch block try block also while loop and now we are ready to execute our code okay what we did first we added text view then created its instance inside on create method then set movement method to scrolling then created string name data which is null then created instance of string buffer and input string string buffer is later appended with our data whereas input stream has our sample file so we are reading sample file and then appending that data into a string buffer and then that string buffer data is displayed on screen okay so this is pretty much our simple program is and you can open emulator and run this code okay so as you can see our content is displayed on Android screen and you can scroll it and your scroll bar will be visible on the right okay so this is my text file that displays this text content you can do the formatting by adding few more specific appended parameters such as I have used n which should be slash n and also you can use tab along with it so slash t so that will help your content to have some margin and each paragraph will be on new line okay sorry for not using slash n but you can get that part covered okay so this was a simple example on how to read text file in Android.